Welcome back to the Techmoto channel. In this episode we will be downloading the weather, and Jarvis will give you a report. Let's start a new file, and call it weather.py. For this function we need to use another a, p, i, in a similar way to hue lights, and other functions that need to get data from the internet. A, P, I, stands for, application, programming, interface, and is basically where we pull data from another system. The system we are going to use for this demonstration is the, open weather map. Let's go to their website. Click on API on the top menu bar. At this point you need to select which type of report you require Jarvis to give. For this video we are choosing, current, weather, data. If you click on the, A, P, I, doc button it gives you lots of instructions on how to use it in your code. Go back to the previous page. You can see that you can have a variety of different packages. For our demo, we will be using the free option. Click on the button that says, get, A, P, I, key. You will need to create an account. Once you are past the sign up process, you will have the option to click on a menu item called, A, P, I, keys. Give your key a name, then click generate. You now have a long string of letters and numbers that you need to copy and save for your code. Let's add the two imports we need for this program, P, Y, T, T, S, X, 3, and requests. OK. So the first thing we need to do is write a function called weather. Let's create a variable called API address. I have removed my API key from this video, but just paste in your generated code after the app ID and equals sign. You then need to enter in your location. I have put a random place name in here. Then select your units, I have chosen metric. Add in the following lines of code to get Jarvis to speak your weather. Don't forget that you will need your speak function for this to work. If you don't have that yet, go back to a previous tutorial to copy this into your code. The code for this video is also available on GitHub. The URL for this is in the description. You will notice that in this function we have called another function called getWeatherData. Let's create that now. def getWeatherData, then in the parenthesis we will call in data that we need. This function calls upon three more functions to obtain, weather type, temperature and wind speed. You can add as many of these as you like. I have chosen these three, and put them above the original function. We then write the sentence as we want it to be read out by Jarvis. The weather in, is currently, with a temperature of, degrees, and wind speeds reaching, kilometers per hour, then we add in the bits that are missing by calling those variables. That's it. If you copy my code from GitHub, all you will need to do is change the API key, your city and units and you will be good to go. Then, in your Jarvis code just call the function weather, when your user says what is the weather like. Simple. That's it for this one. Please do like, and subscribe to my channel. Have a great day. Goodbye.